Hi everyone, welcome back. All right, Ulta 21 Days of Beauty Haul. Let's rock this. I'm gonna make this as fast as possible for you guys. I literally have eight orders. <clears throat> so I'm just gonna fly through it and at the end I will tell you what full retail would have been compared to what I paid and my overall savings. I think I killed it. I did pretty, pretty well. <laughs> no complaints. Okay, first order. Becca Blushes picked up Lantana. I picked up four of them total. Hyacinth. Nighting, Nightingale. It's a beautiful one. And Flower Child. And there is Flower Child. Gorgeous. And obviously there was no two limit because I got four and they were all the regular price. I did pick up throughout the sale multiple of the Julep It's Whipped Matte Lip Mousse. So I started with this first color, Bijou. Kind of like a nude color. Like the formula, it's kind of like a soft matte lip cream. But by Julep. And these were retail of $20 normally and they were $12 throughout the 21 days of beauty. So I think I picked up one, two, about five total. Okay, so on the Becca order, I'll just tell you quickly, uh, retail, full retail without any of the discounts would have been $148. I only paid $46 total, which was a savings of 69%. And that order there, there's five items. So it came to $9.20 per item which for Becca Blush, I'll take it. Uh, the next order I placed was Lorac, and those were, they retail for 22 a piece, and they were at 11. So I picked up the Daylight Highlighter, the Blush in Vivid, and the other highlighter in Starlight. Gorgeous brushes. So the retail on this would have been full retail, $66. I paid $21. So I saved 69% on this also order also. Um, just so you know, I had around a little over $200 in Ulta Bucks. So that's why every order, say it was $66. Um, well, it actually came to like $33. So I used $12 and brought the orders down almost by half on every order. Okay, the next one was Tarte. With these Tarte double-sided. What are they called? Double Duty Beauty, the Lip Sculptor Double-Ended Lipsticks. I have Rogue. Deep, vampy shade. I showed these definitely on Instagram. I probably showed most of it because I've been holding off to do the video. And then the other side is the gloss. These are great. And these retail for normally $24 a piece. I also picked up Sass. Beautiful shade. I haven't even used these yet. I do have two others in my collection also. And Intoxicating. Another kind of berry shade. I also picked up two more of the Julep. And I picked up XOXO and Pucker Up. So it's like a pink and a purple. And I also picked up from Bare Minerals. Bare Minerals was probably five times points. So you'll see random Bare Minerals purchases through here. That's because I wanted the five times points to add to my points. And this is the Gloss in Flirt. I love this Gen Nude line. This stuff. Nude shade. Okay, so this full retail would have been 130. I only paid 54. Total of nine items came to six dollars each. Okay, so that was the third order. Fourth order. Um, yeah, this wasn't on sale, but I saw it and had to have it. The Vera Wang Princess line. This is Princess Revolution. Oh, it's gonna have a little. It's. It, Red. Oh, I don't know if you can see it. I have a picture of this up also. 
So obviously that wasn't on sale. That was just a little me thing. I picked up two of the It um, Tight Line Full Lash Length Black Mascara Primers. When it's half off, that's the best time to buy two of something. Because why not? It's like, buy one, get one free. So this has an extra... I like this on my lower lash line. Very, very thin. It is so you can tight line. This reminds me of the NYX one that I use that has this very small uh, wand. And I use it on for my lower lashes. I have used it on my upper lashes too. Okay, so we got two of those. I picked up another Gen Nude lipstick. This is in Mantra. I haven't even used this yet either. I've just been piling this bag. Plus, um, obviously got shout out to G, Nouveau Cheap. I did get all of the free gifts with every purchase of plus their stuff and all that. Uh, I picked this up due to the five times points. Bare Minerals, thank you, gorgeous. It says $20, but on here it was only $14. So I did grab it. That was like one. I don't know how many are here. Five. Five mini Marvelous Moxie lip glosses. Cute little gift. You know, here's a little, like an ornament. Okay, so that was my fourth order. Full retail would have been $142. I paid $68. And I saved 53%. I mean, the perfume, obviously, this was 60 alone, so this kind of threw off my order. But I do love the Vera Wang Princess perfume line. Okay, the next one, order five, Urban Decay, the Afterglow blushes. I did post these. This is Quickie. Also picked up Bang, bright orange. This will be a fun color when I'm tanning. I'm the only person that probably tans in the winter. I didn't probably tan all summer because I was doing swatches and stuff for you guys. And I also picked up Crush, which is a kind of medium pink. I'm glad I went and swatched these first in store. These were the only three shades I really liked. The rest were very, very light. And I'm not that dark skin tone, but it would have took some building, so I didn't even bother. Uh, this order, full retail, would have been $78. I only paid $27, so I saved 66%, and so I only paid $9 each for these blushes, which are, like I said, $26 a piece. That was my fifth order. Sixth order. I hope I don't feel like I'm rushing you guys, but long videos, I know. They're murderous. Okay, the Stila palettes. I picked up medium tan, tan deep. These are gorgeous. These re retail for $39.50, so you might as well save $40, and they were $19.50. So this is the medium tan. This eyeshadow shade is mm, beautiful. And this is the tan deep palette. And this shadow shade too is, mm. but the whole palette itself is gorgeous. So I picked up those and picked up two more <laughs> of the julep. It's whipped matte, what are they called? mousse. So I picked up a more and moi. It's like a pink and a deep berry. This one's a little patchy, the deeper shades, but you kind of run into that a lot with a lot of deeper shades. Okay, so full retail on that order would have been 119 I only paid 33 Saved 73% on that one, which was a good one. Uh, four items, only came to $8.25 each. So basically a $40 palette cost me $8. That's a score. Okay, next order. This was when they had the Too Faced sale. So I picked up the La Mats lipsticks. I picked up the shades Pitch Perfect. And the shade, da, da, da. hey girl. I have a medium pink shade. Now, Too Faced actually got thrown up with the five times points, so that worked out well to get five times points on those. And every year I do buy the holiday set. So this one's called Park Avenue Kisses. This is this box it comes in. 
also comes with a really cheap plasticky bag. But I do like the lipsticks. They do give you another matte. So I ended up with Rebel Heart, which is a red. And then two of the La Creme in Sugar Daddy and Pink Chocolate. I think they're both just nudes. But I always buy this set every year. I don't think I have these other two shades. This pink Cadillac shade looks beautiful. Anybody going to BeautyCon? I'll be in BeautyCon tomorrow in New York. If you see this, yell at me. Say hi. <laughs> I'm very friendly, trust me. Okay, so, like I said, five times points on all the Too Faced. Full retail of that would have been 73. I only paid 33. So I saved 55%. It can go either way of, I don't know if you want to say it's five lipsticks total, because there's five, so it would come out to 660 per lipstick. Or if you just want to say three items total, came to $11 per item. And my last haul, uh, I'm going to get everything in my way here. Sorry. I tried to just lay it all out to get it ready. I had to clear this entire desk off. Okay. Uh, this was the day they had the Lipstick Queen. This is Jean. It's a pretty shade. It's actually just kind of light and very glossy. Really not a lot of color payoff on it. But I've never tried Lipstick Queen and because this retails alone for $22. Uh, since Too Faced was still five times point, I picked up the little lip injection ornament. Yeah, I love this stuff. And this is where I also picked up the Re ah, Makeup Revolution Ultra Strobe Bombs. I'll give you guys swatches of these. This was so hard to photograph. I don't even know if you'll see it in here. It has this one's euphoria yes i jammed it with these big claws i got on so this is the one that shifts pink and then hypnotic these lights are just gonna make it look this is the gold one let's see if we can wait a minute pink and the gold hopefully you'll be able to see them now ah me with swatches, I know, I know. Okay, so this is the pink, this is the gold. I've been using this pink for the past couple days as a base, and then I've been putting other pink highlighters over it, but these are gorgeous. And the Makeup Revolution was buy one, get one, 50% off. So that's why I added it to the order. I'm gonna wipe my hand up. Okay. I think that is all of it. This full retail would have been $72. I paid $27, saved 63%, and it brought six items down to $4.50 a piece. Oh, I forgot you. I got the um, Shea Moisture Fruit Fusion Coconut Water Energizing Bath, Body, and Massage Oil. And I picked up two of them because they were buy one, get one half. And I was able to use the $3.50 off coupon too, which was great. And this is the Coconut and Hibiscus. These are great massage oils. It gives you the slip, but it also gives you enough tack to it so you can, you know, get a decent massage out of the deal. So that is all of it. I had a total of 38 items. Oh God, you guys wanna see the free stuff? This is most of it. Like I said, G from Nouveau Cheap had these up. So it's the It's the 10, I got a couple of those. The Matrix shampoos. The Living Proof Pre-Treatment Shampoo, Nightcap Overnight Protectors. I think I have a, two more of these and two of these. Uh, free Stila, Stila, Stila Mascara. And plus all the other freebies they give you, the packages, those are junk. Oh, and with the perfume, <clears throat> I did get this travel bag here. It's pretty big, actually. Good size. Okay, that is definitely all of it. Total items, 38. Now, this is where we get good. Full retail, if I just went and went and bought all this, full retail, no coupons, no savings, none of that, $828. I only paid 
overall for all this, 309. So on the whole bit of it, just lumping it all together, I saved 63%, which is, I'll take it. And it comes down to $8.13 per item, which I will take all day long. So definitely a huge shout out to G from Nouveau Cheap for all the updates on all the freebies that were going on because they were bouncing in and out. I'm sure I have more somewhere around here. But I think that was a pretty good old the haul. Not bad for the 21 days. I didn't expect to do all of these, but some of them get thrown in. I definitely wanted the Becca blushes. That was fabulous. The Urban Decay, like I said, I'm glad I went and swatched them first because they weren't having the color payoff. Uh, Too Faced, great lipsticks. I do like their lipsticks. I really like these julep ones. I'm glad I grabbed the shades that I liked while I did. Gotten all the points with the bare minerals here and there. The Stila palettes, the Lorac. I think I did a pretty good haul for 21 Days of Beauty. Okay, if you have any questions, feel free to ask me. You know I'm willing to answer anything. Hope everyone had a wonderful day. Like I said, I'm going to be at BeautyCon tomorrow in New York City, Pier 36. It's from 12 to 6. I know I'll be there by noonish, somewhere in there. Me and my girlfriend Gina will be going. She's tall, blonde hair. You can't miss us. If rain or shine, we're there. We're going to grab some fun and guess you'll be getting a BeautyCon vid to go with it. And I'm now on Snapchat. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm going to attempt to do it while I'm there. If I screw it up, I'm sorry. I just have no idea. I think my handle thing, Brenda Bewitch 17 I, I don't know what I'm doing with it. Just help me. Help. <laughs> okay, everyone have a fabulous night. I wanted to get this up before I left for New York tomorrow so I can show you my next BeautyCon haul because I have no idea what's going to go on there. I haven't been to BeautyCon. I always do IMAT and the makeup show. So this is a new one for me. Wish me luck. All right, I'll see you guys soon. Bye.